Hello and welcome to another installment of Red Stoners. We have a couple of new faces today. Uh, one not so new, um, another one you should really know, and the newest of the new. So we'll start with the ones you should know a little bit better than the others. Uh, we have Matt with us today. Say hi, Matt. Hello. Uh, hi, we, Matt. Also, <laughs> we also have Mike. Look up and say hi. Hello. And finally, last but not least, we have Jack. Hello. Jack is our, um, uh, our Resident DM. Gay man. Yeah, Resident Gay Man and Dungeon, <laughs> and dungeon Master. Not, <laughs> he's our gay Dungeon Master. So, um. <laughs> Oh my God. <laughs> uh, we were saying the other day, Jack, how your identity is the gay man. <laughs> <laughs> I have now solidified this. So, uh, yeah, no. hooray! So, um, it's yeah. a fact on the internet now. So, it, it, it's, it's, it, it, it's it's on it's online now. Everyone knows you're, you're out. A, you're, you you are out, gay man. <laughs> <laughs> we've, we've outed you on the internet, dude. I'm sorry. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, um, as you can see. Um, if you remember from our previous episodes, we started building a base and it was shit. So, um, yeah, let's uh, <laughs> let's fix that. Let's do something about that. Let's Correct follow our Ashley lead. made this terrible, <laughs> terrible entrance to a base. <laughs> it looks a lot like one of my entrances. Yeah. <laughs> to, Ashley, to a base. Ashley is not with us because he had to go Betty Buys. <laughs> Did we get a message from him, by the way? No, he just went, you know what, I'm going to go to bed. <laughs> <laughs> so, are we just, uh, are, we, are we tearing it down? Yeah. Fight the machine. Take this this thing. <laughs> Tear down this wall. Why can't I pick up this door? Oh. Reagan, smash. Okay, so there should be quite a lot of, like, uh, dare I say, cobblestone. <laughs> <laughs> Dreaded cobblestone. Right, it's in the earth box for some yeah. reason. It's from the earth. Everything from the earth. No, it's not. Some things are from space. <laughs> the crafted earth, which contains no earth. Uh, yeah, where's the chisel? I want to show Jack the chisel. Is it a euphemism? I'm just going to stand back and watch everyone <laughs> opening and closing boxes. <laughs> it's the box game! It, need, it, it needs some music. It needs that. Oh, crap, I think it is, you know. I have my corpse. I have a Oh, my corpse. To be fair, people opening boxes is excellent TV. <laughs> so I can't hear you over all the boxes. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Where's the iron? We have no iron. Welcome to Fox TV. Right, I'm guessing we have no. There's a block of iron, iron here. By the. Right, good. By the. Uh, what is this? I need uh, an iron ingot. Huzzah! So where's where's Jack? Jack. I'm here. Hello. Here. Take this. <laughs> Mighty tool. <laughs> that is would have a happy chisel. Christmas. Um, if you pick up this cobblestone, which I'll just spew out Bleh. at your feet. Wow, that's <laughs> disgusting. Um, what did you eat? If you right-click with it in your hand, you can then... No, no, with the chisel in your hand. Ah. And then drag the cobblestone into the left-hand box. Drag it. Drag it. Drag it. And then you can choose which pattern you want on it, which is how we've got all these crazy patterns on the wall. Oh, my God, that's a thing. <laughs> but you can do this with quite a lot of the, the basic, like, decorative blocks. Pack of Hylie. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Yes. Why, what? You put a pumpkin on your head. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Matt. <laughs> okay, so shall we like gather gather all this cobblestone and go make yeah. a base? Yeah. Build me a base worthy of mortal. All right. <laughs> all right. <laughs> 
You know there's chiseled cobblestone and shit in here. You ready to go? Yeah, why not? Let's go. Come on, on then. Actually, I'll take a, take a crafting bench with us. Uh, I'm waiting for stuff. these people. Right. I'm still browsing. Browsing! <laughs> browsing! I'm browsing! <laughs> browsing! <laughs> yeah. I am grout. Where is the food? Yeah, the there is food I could do. In the food. box marked food. Ah. <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> this is outrageous. <laughs> right, so I think first order of business is to make some kind of interesting bridge across this water. I have stairs. Cobblestone. Geronimo. Then make it go up. So Jackie's, I just... Jackie's Sorry, our on. resident architect. Gay man. It's pronounced gay man. <laughs> 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 he puts the gay in gamer. Um... <laughs> yeah. Um, Whether they want so him to or not. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Moving on. Um, so, we were going to build up here. Um, we're going to have to somehow design something that looks a bit like Jason's face. Yes, we've decided to make a base with my face as the entrance. It's the face base. Ah, we face all made base. this decision as a team. As a team, we decided Jason's face. With the lady's <laughs> permission. It's good to know. <laughs> Right. He is a glorious leader. I am the glorious leader. Yar. He's no, a very I have important man. No idea how you want to do that. I oh, have what? no idea either. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent start. So we've made some kind of interesting bridge, which is, which is, a good start. Well Thank done. you, Jen. Well done, everyone. That's a mm -hmm. nice yes, boulder. That's quite a nice bridge. <laughs> <laughs> it's getting dark. <laughs> Well, right. that's a good day's work. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, shall we go back to the beds and reset it to dawn? Yeah. Yes. 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 <laughs> uh, we don't have a front door anymore. Yeah, but if... <laughs> uh, uh, we also can't get in because Tom put a block up there. <laughs> I will protect us with stairs. Oh, I'm going to move some of these beds because they don't work like this. <laughs> It just goes, this bed is in an invalid location. Oh, sod it. Just, Wait, just get in the bed. Break the spawn location. I can only oh. sleep at night. Oh, it's already... No. Is it, is it already daytime? <laughs> oh, we didn't move them, so that's fine. Out of the hole! Oh, yeah. I, I don't have a pickaxe. I can only put stairs in place. I why can't did, get rid why, of them. Why, why did you put stairs there? Because that's what I have in my inventory. But why did you put them <laughs> Not there the in question. the first place? To stop monsters getting in during the night. But we were about to sleep. That turns it into day. That is how it works. That's not how time works. <laughs> In right. Minecraft it is. So Mike and Jack, you were not here for the first, yes. first um, bunch of episodes and recording. No. So now, in an attempt for us to better express ourselves and who we are to our viewers, I've compiled a <laughs> list of questions. So, oh God. Jack, pick a number Yay. between 1 and 13. Pick a number between 1 and 13, did you say? Yes. 7. Would you rather um, always be slightly overdressed for events or slightly underdressed? We know the answer to yes. this already. Yes. <laughs> overdressed. Overdressed. <laughs> Why? <laughs> What's your reasoning? Because I'm gay, I suppose. I knew he was going to say that. <laughs> <laughs> I kid you not, that is question 7. <laughs> That's fantastic. <laughs> oh, I just had a thought. Do you know this this bridge we've made? We could make it go into mm. a tunnel. Ooh. Ooh. Yes, Although, if your face is up there, that would look really disturbing. Well, this this could be one entrance into the base. <laughs> <laughs> and then we have Jason's tongue going down the, the cliff side here. This could like be a tongue. slip and slide. I was more thinking it could be my anus. <laughs> what if your face is up there and your anus is down? What? You do this not know how flexible pose. dragons really are. <laughs> <laughs> like you noodle dragons. Okay. <laughs> noodle dragons can like. Well, they're noodles, aren't they? <laughs> 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 Jesus. <laughs> 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 
is a noodle dragon. <laughs> he has a noodle dragon. <laughs> a noodle dragon. <laughs> Mike, pick a number between 1 and 13. That is not number uh, 7. Let's go straight for number 13, shall we? Would you rather never be able to speak ever again, or always say everything that is on your mind? Ah! <laughs> we know the answer uh, to this it's one. It's funny, actually. <laughs> I've already made this decision earlier in my life. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, given uh, that you're talking, I know what the answer is. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's definitely saying everything that's on my mind. I think that would be terrible. I wouldn't want that. It would, but it's because I you're a horrible person. <laughs> yeah, actually, it is because I'm a horrible. <laughs> 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 so like, you can't say that. Just did, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> In fact, I'm fairly the cussing. Sure that's what like on here. It's not the cussing I mind. It's the weird arguments he has with himself. So I can actually make an an elevator down here, Nathan. Okay. That's what my plan is. Um, I'm not sure if I can make it go sideways, like glass elevator style. That'd be quite cool. And long ways and slab ways. Sideways and up ways and sideways and long ways. Square ways and front ways and any other ways that you can think of. And the snazberry tastes like snazberry. Jen, pick a number between one and thirteen. Uh, five. Go Would you rather man. see into the future or change the past? <laughs> well, you have to choose one. No, I don't. <laughs> so would you rather question? <laughs> a part of your system. <laughs> um, I would really, really rather neither. Really rather neither. I suppose change the past? Ooh, why? I don't want to see into the future. <laughs> <laughs> That's a very good reason, I have I would, to say. <laughs> I would change the past I'd so that I didn't number. have to see in the future. <laughs> <laughs> I would change the event that caused me to be able to go back into the past. <laughs> <laughs> There's a paradox for you. There's a paradox, definitely. Matt. Yes. Choose a number. One. Would you, would you rather be without elbows or be without knees? <laughs> I would say probably without knees. I think this is this is big enough, Nathan. Okay. Without knees, why? Well, because at least then I could still eat. I could kind of move myself around <laughs> on a different part. <laughs> knees, you know, you can live without knees. Yes. Kind of. You don't you you get to cycle food. anywhere. I don't cycle anywhere anyway. <laughs> you wouldn't, probably wouldn't be able to drive. Is that? Well, yeah. That's 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 the other side of this. <laughs> Let's keep going. Drive me. Go on, Nathan, your turn. Um, six. Uh, Star Wars or Star Trek? Uh, Star Trek. Why? Because Jar Jar Binks. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much yeah, there's that. A theory. There's a theory going around that Jar Jar was not the oath that everyone thinks he was. What, he was actually Palpatine? It. He was just misunderstood. <laughs> <laughs> we just misunderstood. <laughs> no, no, it's Sandy, problem. Um, some kind of like secret agent who pretends. Yeah, to be it was. Open. He's the a master of the um, drunk fighting style. <laughs> Whatever it's called, you know, the drunk master thing. Maybe. You have read a very really? different theory to me. Yeah, really? very different than I saw. <clears throat> Mine, he was uh, like a secret Ooh. Sith agent trained in the ways of the Force and this yes. kind of stuff. Basically, so bringing about the Emperor. Um, so but all of that, for that to be true, George Lucas would have to be a fucking genius, and we know he's not. <laughs> <laughs> so he's basically River. Yeah. He's like a yeah, one. back to reality. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he's like a less Misa smart. Misa found George. a microdot. <laughs> he's like a less smart George R. R. Martin. <laughs> <laughs> oh, George R. Biggs is the fat one. 
<laughs> no, that's Boss Nass. <laughs> I think he's referring to Jabba the Hutt. Yes, I am. Oh, right. <laughs> okay. Wow. <laughs> also, um, Star Trek has um, Q, who's like one of the best characters ever created. He's the bad guy in My Little Pony. Yes, I, I agree. That's still awesome. <laughs> It's the one saving grace of My Little Pony in my eyes is the fact that you do have Q. It has Q, literally Q, because it's not... I know, I know, like, I know. The voice actor, it Ooh. might as well be the same character. Yeah, it pretty much is. Yeah. And don't be. forget, he's also... That same actor is responsible for so many deaths in <gasps> Breaking Bad. <laughs> yes, yeah. he is. Yes, he is. He's probably got a higher kill count than Walt. <laughs> <laughs> you also have not my proxy. Have the, you also have the likes of the Borg, which are a cool bad guy. Anyway, and the yes, dislikes so, of the Borg. Ne ne next person. Uh, it's me. EJ's so someone needs to choose a number for me because I've got the questions in front of me. <laughs> Go on, Jack. Oh, you died. You pick one. <laughs> <laughs> Three. Three. Oh, would I go to solitary confinement for a year in exchange for a million pounds? Well, that's an easy one for oh, you. Yeah. Now... <laughs> that would be awesome. <laughs> it would be solitary <laughs> confinement for a year. Yeah, but you hate awesome. people. I do hate people, but then again, I love my fiancé, so that's quite oh. difficult. Oh, bar. You have to think twice. <laughs> that's 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 love right there. Yeah, just think of the right money there. that you got out. I love you oh, enough you to be financially secure. <laughs> I am a man being all romantic and nice and deep and sensitive. Take the money. <laughs> to be fair, if you were cool with it, I would totally do it. <laughs> I know you would, and you probably enjoy it. So I probably would lose <laughs> part of my mind, but yes, I would also enjoy oh. it at the same time. <laughs> Only part. Uh, it depends so on. Cool. It really depends on this how deep the solitary confinement is. I, is it a room with nothing to do? Or yeah, is it, like, it will just be like uh, I imagine it as being basic meals, bed. That's it. It's just a room with your own thoughts. Just yes, meditate. Yeah. I would constantly. literally go nuts True. for quite some time and then be at peace with myself. Then probably <coughs> um, go nuts some more. <laughs> <laughs> Very All oh, work and no play. All <laughs> no beer and no TV make Homer something. Something, something. something. <laughs> go crazy? Don't, Don't mind, mind if I do! do. <laughs> <laughs> um, you'd be mining rather than building a base. That's what, so. I was going to say this. I was wondering. I'm if stuck. It was only because we were shot on coal and I'm not stuck anymore. Everything. Somehow we used everything in the last. Where's all the tools? I couldn't find any tools. Before. Oh, Jack. Here. Thank you, Matt. <laughs> that should last because you're wearing the. Because you're wearing the pumpkin head, when you eat carrots, it just looks like the pumpkin is regurgitating part of itself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, I should. No, I can't eat any more. No, I'm not hungry. I should be with you guys because Jason's a jacket though. Whoa. Um. Yeah. Oh, I, I walked I away. You <laughs> yeah, try and follow us. Otherwise, we we miss everything. Oh yeah, because we're the cameraman. Yes. Mm. She changed my like head in the Minecraft skin to be a big camera just to remind everyone. <laughs> <laughs> that would be so scary. <laughs> I am watching you. Well, there's um in a graphic novel series that Christine's reading, uh, Saga, you have people with TVs for heads. Oh, I want to get that. Mm. It's a really and, good series. And um, when, I, I read the first couple. It is. Mm. When, whenever they're like feeling a certain emotion and that, their their emotion comes up as a TV clip. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> that is cool. Awesome. But they're Jack. also they're also bastards. Yeah. <laughs> Choose a number. Um. Oops. Oh. Do you want me to, do you want me to rejig the list so you can choose a, just a number between one and like five or something? No, it's fine. Um, number. That's been taken! No, it hasn't. Uh, That's the last uh, one I did. Uh, yeah, it was. Um, 
number two. If you had a warning label, what would yours say? <laughs> <laughs> okay, shall I re flog the old with the dead horse? Uh, no. um, <laughs> re re flog the old horse? <laughs> That's a strange <laughs> label. <laughs> Reflog the horse. <laughs> um, a warning label. Um, it would probably just say, stay away. <laughs> Day <laughs> way. <laughs> Didn't you say AIDS? <laughs> <laughs> stay away. AIDS. <laughs> I think I just picked up all your stuff. Sorry, there was a there was a thing to pick up, and I decided to pick it up. Um, what did you have? You had this. <laughs> story, bro. I know. Such story. Oh. Wow. Um, was there anything else in here? I don't know. I think it would say something like "danger, overactive imagination." <laughs> yeah, I, I, that's I, probably, yeah. I was going to go with "danger, danger, high voltage." Yeah. <laughs> I used to have a T-shirt that said "Do not disturb, already disturbed." I loved a lot of the time. <laughs> <laughs>